Hello again, everyone. Welcome back to Ultima 7 Part 2, Serpentile. We are exploring the Dream Realm, hoping that we don't encounter encounter the Shadow uh, Lords or the uh, the Martians uh, from Martian Dreams. Which, honestly, okay, so they're not actually going to be here, but that would have been pretty awesome if they were, honestly. This is like, I feel like this is a real missed opportunity that they were not in there. Kill the, kill it, th please. Thank you. Hmm. Who is this? Hail Minstrel. I had wondered when, when I would encounter thee here, Avatar. I expect that thou wouldst like some answers, no doubt. Or perhaps I could sing thee a song to ease thy way. Uh, I would rather have the answers, thank you. Thou mayest find that the answers only give rise to more questions. But I shall do my best to help thee. First, thou shouldst know that thou dost walk in the land of dreamers. Yeah, I gathered that. There are only two ways to enter or exit here. Uh, two ways? The first is to enter this realm... The first way to enter this realm is from the safety of thy bed in thy nightly slumber. The second way to enter here is far more perilous. By falling prey to the enchantments in Gorlob Swamp. Why didn't you warn me about this earlier? <sighs> Tell me about Gorlob Swamp. Long ago, even before the Serpent People made this land their home, a sorcerer named Rabindranath swore to destroy the peaceful town of Gorlob. Why would... Why would a, uh, a forum poster on uh, various Dungeons and Dragons forums uh, want to destroy the peaceful town of Gorlab? I should ask him. But the town hero, healer, Siranush, opposed him and the evil spell went awry. The inhabitants of the town were not destroyed, but were instead trapped within the realm of dreams. If only I had played one of the earlier Ultima games, Gorlap might sound familiar. Ah, that's probably nothing. Along with the mad sorcerer, and any who dare enter the environs of Gorlap. Again, why did you not warn me about this? Tell me about Rabindranath. Rabindranath has, hath struggled mightily against Siranush across the span of time. Each of his attacks have been repelled, much to his displeasure. Displeasure? Rabindranath releases his anger by troubling the thoughts of those who venture here within their dreams. Great. Uh, Siranush. Siranush is a strong-willed woman who hath repelled all of Rabindranath's attacks on her people. She is no sorcerer, and I fear that her strength will one day fall, fail her, even though she's been doing a pretty darn good job for the last, I don't know, how many hundreds in year, of years, maybe even thousands of years. Were Siranush to be vanquished, I am sure that Rabindranath would turn his evil intent on the wandering dreamers. Without Siranush's guidance, those who enter here might never leave. Leave? As I said before, there are two ways to enter the land of dreamers. If thou didst come here from the comfort of thy bed, thou canst simply awaken, and thou wilt return to the land of waking men. But if thou didst come here th through the enchantments in the swamp, thou must die here to return to thy body. What? To die, I do not mean that thou must cease living. I mean that thy perceived life here must end. Thy death here returns thee to thy body. So long as Siranush prevails and the, thy body lives, thou canst return to the world of waking men. But if Siranush should fail, fall, or thy body die, thou shalt remain trapped here for all time. Alright, give me a song. Uh, new song. Within the great wide forest, hard on the snow and ice... There dwells a man called the Forest Master, who rules both plant and beast. His power by cruel thieves one day from him was stolen. And now with the one great tree doth wilt without his tender care. So if thou dost seek favors from the Forest Master Fierce, thou shouldst be prepared to return to him the Orb of Elarion. It's not much of a song, but thanks anyway. Farewell, Gleeman. Jerk, for not telling me about this earlier. <sighs> well, as long as we're here, I'll take this cheese, and the butter, and the delicious cancer-causing meat. Uh, let's see. Well, well, the stairs aren't here. That's weird. And this is a, the uh, uh, sleeping bowl.
I want the sea shanty, damn it. Where's the sea shanty? I don't remember which one was which. That's not it. Ah, pretty. That's not it. Too slow. Not sea shanty! Ah. Uh, I feel better now. Alright, let's see. Where else could we go? Alright, this is uh, one of the weird things about this uh, um, dream realm. So, we're over here. We're now over here. Uh, I guess because they couldn't fit it anywhere else on the map, uh, it's awfully wide, it actually rotates. Or, not rotates, it, uh, um, spans the, uh, uh, or wraps, it wraps, that's what I'm looking for. Uh, let me get to that part of the map, which is why I wanted to go north, uh, f to start with. Um... So, let's go ahead and, uh, well, north, uh, uh, east, I should say. Let's go this way now. Avatar, why art thou in my dream? I was looking for Gweno. Oh, perhaps I have intruded upon thy dream. Forgive me, I shall go seeking my wife and leave thee to thy dream. Thanks, I guess. Bye, Iolo. Uh, who the hell was that? Oh. Who left these open? Uh, oh, hey! It's Cantra. Hey, help me! I cannot escape! It will catch and devour me! Canst thou not see it? Please help me! Uh, what, what are you talking about? Art thou blind? Canst thou not see the foul beast? Have mercy, I beg thee to slay such a horror! Such an horror? Please, thou must kill it before it takes me. Uh, no, I, I can't see it. I don't know what you're talking about, kiddo. Well. Ooh. I'll take this jewelry, though. Thanks. Uh, hey, a ring of regeneration? I'll take that. Lockpicks? I'll take that. Don't actually want to wear the Ring of Regeneration, which I imagine it put on. Rings of Regeneration, Rings of Invisibility, they're too good to, uh... They're too good to use. They really are. Alright, well... I'm sorry, kiddo, but, uh, don't know what you're talking about. That does not sound good if this is what, uh, uh, she's saying in her dreams. Kill it! Kill it! Dream creature. Kill it! Thank you. Sheesh. Ooh. Twenty-five. This doesn't heal? Ah, Cheap. Oh, hey. A silver leaf tree. It's a rather thick dream forest here. Hey, there's a house. Well, let's explore this little dream forest first. See if there are any uh, tree, uh, trees with hollows in them. There do not appear to be any. Disappointed. Hello. Thou hast come at last. I am Siranush. I have been expecting thee. I knew that thou art the one destined to free us from the Rabindranath's evil spell. Uh, expecting? As Edrin hath told thee of me, he hath dreamed of thee. 
I know that thou w wouldst come. Twas only a matter of time. Oh, hey. Oh, that's right. Um, Hedrin said something about you. Uh, tell me about Ravendranath. Ravendranath was a haughty mage who moved into our town shortly after I became the healer there. He was very angry when we did not immediately name him to the village council. Ravendranath stormed back to his keep, swearing that we would soon see that he was not he was no one to trifle with. I wish I had understood what he was planning when he began collecting the crystals. Tell me about this evil spell. Ravendranath thought to harness the villagers' dreams, hoping to gain great power. How can you gra gain great power by harnessing dreams? He intended to use that power to make the village submit to his rule. But a spell went awry. A matter of time. In mine own dreams, I saw that thou wouldst need the serpent necklace. I knew that thou wouldst have to come here before the, thou couldst complete thy quest. Wait, you have the serpent necklace? Tell me about it. "'Tis a thing of power from the people who settled this land after the village of Gorlab existed. It is to be thy reward. How do you have it? Uh, talk about the crystals. Ravendranath bought a vast quantity of dream crystals. I thought them harmless. Small dream crystals were often exchanged by lovers, so that they might see each other in their dreams. I had no idea that he could pervert them so. Uh, awry? I do not know if Rabindranath thought that he would tra tap our dreams and exploit what we feared, or if he planned to steal some of our essence while we, were, while we lay dreaming. Whatever his true plans, when he cast his spell, the power was so great that a rift opened into the dream realm. The people of Gorlab, including the spellcaster himself, were trapped within this land of altered reality. Um, tell me about uh, this quest. Thou art the only one that can hope to save the land from tearing itself apart, Avatar. I do not know what thou must do. I only know that thou must possess the serpent necklace before thou hast hope of succeeding. So I have serpent earrings, I've got a serpent ring, and now there's a serpent necklace. I've also got a serpent crown and a serpent staff. It's a lot of serpent stuff. But first thou must free us. Thing of power? I do not, I do not know what it will do. I only know that it was a part of a set of such jewelry, and it was a symbol of authority of some sort. Tell me about Gorlab. The ruins that lie within the swamp are those of my village, though Gorlab was though Gorlab was not always a swamp. Long ago, Gorlab was once a prosperous community, Avatar. Uh, tell me about this reward. Thou art our only hope, Avatar. Obi-Wan Avatar. Our souls are trapped here, unable to go to what awaits beyond the realm of life. If thou wilt undertake the task I ask, I shall reward thee with the serpent necklace. Uh, pervert. I am no mage, Avatar. The dream crystals were little more than hedge magic. I had no idea that Rabin Rabindranath could use them for anything sinister. Else I would have brought him before the Judicar, and had his powers riven from him. Trapped? We became trapped here, unable to return to our bodies that still lay within the village. Most of the villagers quickly went insane here, where things that are... where things that are not are... Those who resisted initially soon joined their neighbors in insanity when their bodies died. I have done what I can for them, but I cannot cure insanity. And I can do little more than keep Rabindranath's insanity from destroying us. You're pretty powerful for a mere healer. Uh, free? Although it was Rabindranath's spell that trapped us within the dream realm, it is the dream crystal that keeps us from leaving. It is also the crystal that traps any who enter the swamp. Bring to me the dream crystal, and we will all be freed. Uh, authority? I've been trapped for a very long time, Avatar. All I know is that the Ophidians seem to worship serpents, and that artifacts with the serpent symbol were often of magical origin. I have no idea what it will do. Tell me about the swamp. When I was Gorlab's healer, the village stood on firm ground. We held back the swamp and farmed the rich soil. I'm not sure that you can hold back a swamp per se. I mean, you could drain it, certainly, and change the, the um, nature of the place, but how would you, quote-unquote, hold it back? Again, I mean, really the only way is draining it. But after we became trapped in this forsaken place, the earthworks we had built crumbled... Okay, I suppose I could explain part of it. Crumbled and the swamp rose to engulf the village. Still, I... Anyway, destroying... Ravendranath soon discovered that he could alter the dream realm by will alone. I repulsed his attacks until his body at last died too. 
and with this what little sanity he had departed. Rabindranath blamed the people of Gorlab and swore to destroy us all. Our bodies are long moldered away, and our souls remain bound here. If any of us should die here, we will be lost forever. Wilt thou bring me the dream crystal so that we may at last find peace? I fear that soon my strength will fall, fail, and the people of Gorlab and I will be far worse than dead. Yes. Thou art truly as brave as Edrin pictured thee. I can tell thee how to defeat Rabindranath. Uh, talk about the dream crystal first. Thou hast already seen a small part of the whole. The crystal that Edrin wears is a shard of the dream crystal. That is how I was able to speak with him. To find the dream crystal, thou must venture into Rabindranath's keep somewhere within the dream realm. Uh, tell him about defeat. Rabindranath hath styled himself a god here. He cannot be killed as thou wouldst a normal man. He can only be overpowered by the application of truth, love, and courage. In the American way. In order to do this, thou must be armed with, the three, ar with three artifacts. The artifact of courage, the artifact of love, and the artifact of truth. Bring to me the dream crystal from Rabindranath's keep, and we shall at last be free. Hey, wait, 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 whoa. Here, kitty, kitty. Dang it. I didn't want to talk to the cat. Where are you, lady? Ah, there you are. Meow. Thou must return. Hast thou brought me the dream crystal, Amadretta? Not yet. Without the crystal, our souls remain trapped. Bring to me the dream crystal, and the serpent necklace is thine. Dang it. All right, we got a book. Oh, it's just the House of the Unicorn? Well, that must be an old book. Uh, do you have shears? You have no shears. All of this cloth and no shears. No! No. No such thing as fairies. Okay, well. I don't see anything of great interest here. Looks like there might be something on the ground here. Oh, it's just a cat. Okay, well. So we've got to go find this Rabindranath and his keep here in the dream realm. If I would stop getting stuck on things. Uh, let me look around here. Okay, this is uh, functionally a dead end, so that's a good place to go. Searching? For other things to help us along our way, of course. Oh, a rock outcropping, a black rock outcropping. We'll look at that later. Got a bunch of serpent mill serpent pillars, and a... Oh, wow. Oh. Mine. Mine, 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 mine. All mine. All mine. Mine, 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 mine. My treasures. My precious. My precious gold. Can't seem to do anything with the black rock outcropping, though. Uh. Oh, my! Ladies, um, guy, ah, oh, Avatar, this is as it should be. The food is good, the wine is sweet, and the company is warm. Wouldst thou care to join me? Still bound by thy quest, I see. Well, if thou dost change thy mind, thou art welcome here any time. Oh, and Avatar, thou shouldst honestly relax a bit. What? Oh, God, I am disturbed by your dreams, buddy. You and your plain tag with your naked lady friend. Well, it looks suspiciously like the Avatar with no clothes. Alright, so we gotta go find oh, our way down here. Oh, hey, there's a deer. Another deer here. 
Oh, am I not going to be able to get through? <sighs> Screw that. <laughs> I'm not going all the way back up. I don't feel like doing that. Uh, let's see. Aha. This is another place that I want to go. Ooh. Ow! Ow! Hmm. Uh, telekinesis. Create food. Move it, thank you. And translation. Interesting selection of items. There we go. Hmm. The dreams of thine enemies. To battle! Ah, Avatar, thou art never a match for me. Soon I will have power to rival even the Guardian himself, and thou wilt be powerless just as thou art now. Well, it's just because you dreamed of me with no weapons. I will bury my blade deep within thine entrails, twisting it ever so slowly, enjoying each of thy pitiful screams. Farewell, hero of Britannia. Though thou wilt beg for a quick end to thy life, I shall resist. I want to enjoy thy death. Uh. Die, Avatar! Nothing can stop me now! <laughs> hmm. Well, that is indeed dreams of my uh, enemies. Could we get anything else? The blood didn't go away. What if I sit down? Nope, nothing. I don't think that there is anything even uh, hidden down there, so I'm not going to even go bother going in there. Well, now we know what uh, um, Batlin dreams about. It sounds like he has... Uh, He's chafing under the will of the Guardian, even. Don't get caught on that stuff. So we started out here, and... Ah! Right nearby are enemies that we probably would not have been able to uh, defeat. Well, this does look like a uh, castle of some sort. Hmm. Seems like there might be an anti-magic field here. Hello, Nightmare. Hello. Cannot click on you. There are magically locked doors, which is unfortunate. Well. Hast thou seen the Firebird's death or followed thy dreams to seek power? Well, I have seen Firebird's rebirth. Does that count? Look at that grin. Could you... I mean, with a grin like that, how could you not trust this guy? Look at that. Canst thou touch the face of a dream that clutches thee with bony claws? How wouldst thou know the power that leaps from dream to dream, devouring death as it went? Dost thou have the protection of courage to face thy dreams? Can thy hen thine helm face the power and kiss the lips of sweet death? What? Curse the pot metal protection that thou dost call courage! Thou hast not danced with the maker of dreams upon the cold stone grave of power. Well, we're safe there. Uh, the uh, our, our helm of courage uh, protected us. That is a big fire. They're leopard rugs. Oh, by the virtues! Run! Keep away! Damn thee! Die, kitty! There we go. Aw, oh, nothing on the kitty. Kitty! Die, kitty! Bad kitty. You attacked me, after all. I hope these statues don't come to life. That's locked. Ah. 
Oh my. Hey, we've got a demon roast. Ah, very tasty. She ate the plate, too! Well, nah, I don't need the food. Spider plant? Oh my... What the hell are you doing in here? I will take that key, though. Could be useful. The severed limb is still wiggling! There is a loot. Oh, hey! I'll take the fire sword. Thank you. Oh. Why can you not talk to any of the, the uh, uh, Naga ladies? Dost thou have the glass petals of love to bind thy dreams? Canst thou swim in the seas of death and come forth the father of power? Yeah? A thousand plagues upon the putrid flower thou dost call love. Thou canst not walk amongst the clouds of dreams and reap the withered souls of weaklings. Bye-bye. Let's flip that. I don't know what that did, but... Curse thine offspring. Well. Oh. Hey. Good. Ah, don't don't stand in the flames. So is she dead now? Yes. Uh, she ran out of uh Ran out of arrows, apparently. Let's go ahead and take them. These nightmares seem a little bit uh, uh, aggressive, perhaps, or maybe I am just aggressive towards the nightmares. There's a lot of arrows that missed me. Alright, there is nothing else in here. Eh, just a loot. And I got the key on that guy's body. Let's check the walls, look for any... There's another nightmare. Can we uh, double-click on it? Nope. How am I doing on... Uh, eh, 25 hit points, that's fine. No, don't don't play the triumphant music unless we've killed it. There we go. Killed the nightmare, and its hooves still glow. Oh, oh! I forgot that I could get up on the wall. Let's go ahead and do that. Let's see what we have down this way, past these uh, magically locked doors. Can we talk to you, Avatar? How good it is to see thee. How how long hath it been since we last met? I don't know. Who are you? Uh, uh, well... Do not tell me that thou dost not recognize me. Come now, Avatar. It hath not been that long. Well, maybe... It is I, Smith the Horse. Smith! It's Smith, everyone. He, he dreams that he is a nightmare. The finest steed in all of Britannia. Oh, I suppose thou wouldst not recognize me such as I am. This is the appearance I take here at the Realm of Dreams. Ah, this is the life, mine own keep. As much hay as I could want, no insects to bother me. Who could ask for more? Where are my wits? Avatar, I have something important to tell thee. But what was it? Oh yes, Avatar, thou must take Rudium's wand to the Isle of the Avatar. There thou wilt find a monolith made of black rock that Batlin is using to create a gateway to bring the Guardian into our world. The future of Britannia doth lie in thine hands, Avatar. Uh, Smith, the Guardian hath been stopped. Everything is safe. Oh. I feel like I have made a mule of myself. Never mind. Now I remember. Thou hast left Britannia and hast journeyed to the Serpent Isle in search of Batlin. Poor Iolo. He must be distraught to have found that Gweno left on that voyage with that fiend. 
I hope that thou wilt find her before that evil man doth do something to her. She, at least, hath always been kind to me. Wait, Avatar, I do have some information thou canst use. Petlin and his band of hired swords are waiting for thee at... Yummy! Here comes someone with more hay! Damn it, Smith! Even to the last, you fail to give me useful information. I love that they managed to uh, fit Smith into this game. That's... That's just perfect. It's fantastic. It's all there is back there, though. Ah, Smith. Smith, Smith, Smith. One of my favorite Ultima characters. And with that, we'll go ahead and call it an episode. Uh, wow, I've really put stuff in a lot of weird places. Didn't know you could uh, put the lightning whip on the uh, belt. I am actually holding... Oh, yes, that's right, because I'm... <laughs> carrying treasure chests of stuff. Anyway, in the next episode, we will see if we can uh, get through this door and uh, confront Ravindranath one final time and hopefully get to get the dream crystal that uh, um, uh, Siranush was talking about. We shall see, that, see if that happens next time, everyone.